See? Damn it, I knew that was gonna happen. Okay. That's good. Buddy! Yes! Uh, so I'm starting a brand new business and I'm really excited about it. And I wanted to start off the show talking about it. My new business will really be helping people out, you know, really making a difference yeah. in the world. Bunny, here's a question for you. Do you know how many people die every year because of medicine cabinets? Because of medicine cabinet what? Because of medicine cabinets. Oh, just because of medicine cabinets? Yes, I because don't of medicine know. cabinets. How many people do die every year because of medicine cabinets? Okay, okay, fine. Look, I'll walk you through <coughs> it, okay? I'll walk you through it. Here's the situation. You and your family have just purchased a house, and wow, was it ever cheap. And in this housing market, this house is a steal. Sure, there's a few problems, like ghosts in the attic, blood dripping from the ceiling, and a pool full of zombies. But have you seen the crazy prices people are asking for houses nowadays post-pandemic? I mean, hell, I'll take a few rates if the house is that cheap, you know what I'm saying? Well, it's the end of a very long day for you fighting off skeletons and banshees, and all you want to do is brush your teeth, wash your face, and go to bed. So you go to the bathroom, you wash your face. Wait, is there something behind me? No, I guess I was just, I'm, I must be seeing things. I've had a long day. So you open up the medicine cabinet to get your toothbrush. And then what is waiting for you in the mirror when you close the medicine cabinet? You don't even have time to see because boom, you are dead, my friend. You are dead. Medicine cabinets result in 82% of all haunted house deaths every year. So my new business will come to your haunted residence and will wall up your medicine cabinet. Yes. This is my new business. And I really think that, that, that my new business will be helping people out, you know? Helping people that need helping. That's what I'm all about, you know? Yes what I'm all about. Now, full disclosure. That, that, should be, that should be your, like, logo, your tagline. Helping people yeah. who need helping. Helping people who need helping. Now, full disclosure, I do legally have to say this. We are not qualified to deal in any way with the following issues. Ghosts, demons, zombies, monsters, beasts, beasts, wraiths, curses, vampires, chupacabras, angels, demons, angel demon hybrids, gargoyles, hellhounds, jinns, imps, dragons, interdimensional beings, leprechauns, presidents, ex-presidents, nuns, mummies, necromancers, nymphs, poltergeist, Cronenbergs, slender man or slender men, tulpas, unicorns, werewolves, well, or any other slender beings. person. Slender people, yeah. Yes. Women can be slender men, too. We are really, you know, we're, we're all inclusive here. So we cannot deal with any of those supernatural issues. But what we can do is come to your house and seal up the goddamn medicine cabinet. Yes. That's what we're all about. Helping people who need helping in haunted house environments. So I really think that this new business of mine is, is really going to be going places, you know? I have faith uh, in it. I, I have a lot of faith and confidence in this, and I wish you much, much success. You Thank are, you. You are helping people. I'm trying to, yeah. yeah. I'm trying to. And cut on that. <laughs>